Hello you guys, welcome to Journey with Char on this Good Friday. Happy Good Fridays for those of you who celebrate the death, burial, and resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Happy Good Friday to you. I come to you today because last night I went to the grocery store and my son saw this big old Marie Callender's and so I'm going to make this family size. You guys, I have never seen a family size uh, Marie Callender chicken pot pie. Never seen it. I usually eat the, we usually used to eat the banquet one. Mm -hmm. Y'all, the one in the red box, the banquet one was really, really good. Was good. So I'm going to prep this. What I'm going to do is tear some of this foil around and I'm going to put it around the edges and then we're going to put this in the oven for about a one hour and 30 minutes. So you guys stay tuned. Okay, you guys, so we have the pie all prepped and ready. So I put the foil all around the edges. I did not put any egg white or milk wash around the edges. I just put the foil in and that was it. Um, they do have a pie cover like that that goes around the edges. Um, but I don't have one. I do need to purchase one. Anyway, this is the instructions of how everything goes. Saw pot pie five minutes at room temperature. Gently pierce center crust four to five times with a fork to vent. So we're going to do just that. So we're going to, it said the center. So one, two, three, four, five. Let me make sure I'm getting this one. Five. So that's what it says do to pierce it four to five times. That's one, two, three, four, five. And so now just make sure that that is completely one of these little edges want to act up. Okay, I have a baking sheet here. I was going to use parchment paper, ran out of parchment paper. So we're going to put this on top of the baking sheet. Let me move that down. Make sure everything is secured. And voila, that is perfect. So now we're going to put it in the oven. You can take it over to the oven, Mommy. We're going to put it in the oven for one hour and 35 minutes or one hour and 40 minutes. So we're going to do one hour and 35 and um, taste and see. Hopefully, it looks like that when it comes out. Y'all, she at home. It's Friday. I am resting. Whew! Y'all, I've been working so hard five days a week. I usually work only four. I don't like doing five because I like to have doctor's appointments on Fridays or either my mother may have an appointment or just to rest. Four days a week, eight hours, five days a week, eight hours, y'all. It kicks my butt. Anyway, um, my students will be graduating soon this month. Not only that, we've been getting ready for a lot of stuff that's been happening in and around our school. Spring breaks are happening. So y'all, I've just been busy anyway so remember i bought this from the 99 cent store so i wanted to show you guys this is the witch hazel face mask hydrating one and i just opened this so i'm gonna take my glasses off y'all i can't see y'all so i hope i hope this this works okay i can't see nothing y'all i have got to go get my glasses filled but this is what it looks like look at that it is really moist and very wet okay here we go so that is a little face here we go so let me make sure y'all see that oh it smells amazing okay so we're gonna put this on and y'all i got this from the 99 cent store what i like about it so far oh let's get my lips okay it's even got a little nose yes Mama said it's cute, so that's all that matters as long as I'm cute. <laughs> okay, so it's really it real yeah. The I guy did say it. at that place. The what I like is it doesn't smell chemically. So I looked at the ingredients, and I'm going to tell you guys what it says it has. So there we go. Can you pass me a piece of paper towel? So there I go. Hello. I'm looking like Michael Myers a little bit. <laughs> Y'all, trust me, she not that girl. <laughs> Anyway, oh, I can't even put my glasses back on. Let me see if I can see this, y'all. When you hit 40, this is what happens. So, I do love the fact that it's made in the USA. That made me very happy. Oh, it smells so good. 
I'm just gonna do my glasses like this, y'all, so I can see it a little bit. Cause I can't see nothing. Hold on, I can't see anything. If any of you have had that operation, let me know. And if you have, you know the one where you can see better? Let me know if you like it. What was your side effects? Cause I'm really considering it. I leave it on after cleansing face, which I already did that. Pat face dry, which I did that. Apply the mask to the skin, which I did that. Remove the mask gently after 15 to 20 minutes. So if you see these masks at your 99 cent store, get them. Um, I'm trying this. This one is the witch hazel one. So you know how on your Facebook things that pop up sometimes and you're like, oh my God, it's free. All you gotta do is just check it out. This is our new product. So I said, okay, oil belay. Uh, I'll see what's going on. So I did check it, it was real quick. All I had to do was put in my address, name and voila. Didn't have to do any shipping and handling. And they sent this. So this is what came in the mail. This is what it looks like. So it is the Foaming Whip Body Wash Shea Butter. I'm excited about that. You guys see that? So if this pops up in your um, Facebook and they say they want to offer you a new, um, they want to offer it to you for free just to try it. There we go. And so that is it, the Shea Butter. It looks like it's really full, y'all. Okay, and I think they gave me a coupon. Let me see. I'm all about saving an extra dollar. Let's see, did they give a coupon? Whoo, she's so happy. She even got a coupon, y'all. So happy, I'm all about that coupon life. So the coupon did come in the package. How sweet is this? So let's try it. And this is the whip. Cute little package. This is cute for traveling. Um, I don't think they'll let you take this on the airplane, but if you're traveling, you know, by car or whatever, this is really, really cute. So let's see how this, which way does this go? Ooh, y'all didn't see that. Ooh, it smells so good. That girl, look, okay, so y'all look. Ooh, it is so soft and silky. It's a body wash. Can you bring me some water? Bring me a bowl of water. I'm just going to put a little bit more so y'all can see. We're going to see if that foam consistency stays. Okay, y'all. But look, let me just let y'all see the glistening. Y'all see the glistening? This smells so good. When I tell y'all this smells so good, please wow. believe me. So, we have a bowl of water here. So, I did put some on my hand. So, we're going to see if that's going to soap up a little bit more. So, remember, it went away. So, we're going to put some on my hand. Okay. It's a little soapy it came back, but we're going to use it. This is the thing, though. How did that spray go? Hold on. Did it go this way? Oh, so you press down. It's a little confusing, so you press down. You see how that's coming off? Okay, the rest of this is for my bath, y'all. I can't do no more for y'all. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, so then, y'all, look at that. Ooh, she's so excited, y'all. I'm about to wash my arm right here in front of y'all. Look at this. Oh, this is amazing. Ooh. You guys, this is so nice. And I'm thinking this is already in the stores. Ooh. I love the smell. I am loving the smell. So let's see. You don't want too much lather because I'm going to tell y'all something. When it's too much lather, that's not good. It's too much lye or something in it. You want something that's just going to get you clean. And really, mm. and this has shea butter in it. So that is really good. So look at that. Mm -mm -mm. So this is a plus. So remember, when you get it, if you get it from the store, or if you get this as a sample, you press down here, and then it pops up there, which is really cute. It's really made well, and it is a lot of product in this. So if you guys see this as a free sample, uh, uh, make sure you put it in. It wasn't no funny stuff going on, just your simple address. And then uh, you can even put another name. You don't even gotta put your, your real name. You can put another name, send it to your address. And I got this in the mail and it came swiftly, probably in a few days, a couple of days. And how much, how awesome is this? They have all these different flavors. Flavors, y'all, like we gonna eat it. They have all these different scents. I'm gonna let you see that right there. Hopefully you can see the scents. And then this one is a dollar off. So y'all know how the coupons go. So say for instance out here we have the Star News. So if the Star News has coupons, um, Sunday, your Sunday paper. Say for instance you have your coupons in your Sunday paper. 
So if you see a coupon for this oil valet and it's not the exact same coupon as this one, then you can should be able to combine this coupon at your grocery store. Combine this coupon, and if it's already on sale at your grocery store, so say for instance, this is a dollar off the coupon you see in the um, newspaper, is probably 55 or 75 percent off. You got a dollar and 75 or a dollar 50, and then say for instance, on sale in the store, you can combine all that together and literally, and they're bigger than this. This is just a trial size, I'm sure they're bigger than this, and you can save on that. That's what I love about couponing, okay, you guys. So Pay attention to that. All right, now, the next thing I'm gonna do right here is show you guys the other two. I did show you in the video, but as I'm showing you this on my face, y'all see this? Y'all, it feels so good. Like you can feel the tingle on your face, and that's what I like about it. But it's not too tingling, like it's like what product is it, what, what kind of, you know, um, chemicals in there, it's not like that. The next one is the Chondrius Crispus. Face hydrating, so that is that mask there. And guys, whenever I do try this, I will probably do this again or probably not, so whatever. You're seeing how they look. So each mask is like that. And in the box, it's a uh, two single use mask. So you get two of them, I do like, and in the box is pretty heavy. You get a lot of product. Um, this one is the chamomile face hydrating. And like I said before in the videos, I just think the packaging alone is absolutely beautiful. These products are made in the USA. However, I looked them up and I didn't see much of them online. Um, Amazon does sell some of their products, but I didn't see, it was hard to find these little face things. Um, but yeah, so this one is the Witch Hazel uh, Hydrating. And so on each one of them, like I said, is single use. And I'm gonna show you, so that is that one. You can see how the package looks. That's the witch hazel one that I just used. And these are even cute if you want to use them as gifts and make little gift baskets or a little gift bag for your friends. These are even cute to take them out individually and you can make like a little, uh, you know, spa basket. So say for instance, you make a little cute little spa basket. You add all three of these. Even if you had this and didn't want to use it, you can give it to a friend. You can add a buffer. You can add all kinds of little oils, bath oils, whatever, and just create a cute spa basket for somebody. And I think that that is really, really nice. Okay, you guys, my camera stopped. Is it no time for me to take this stuff off my face? <laughs> Yo, we gotta check to see. Look at that, she, like she a little scared. Don't get me mad. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> anyway, so I'll probably have a few more minutes. So this is what it looks like after 15 minutes. There we go. Yes, that's a good towel. And if you can bring that other bowl back over here. So I've got a little towel. I'm not going to scrub. I'm just going to. And so this is what it looks like after. Wait, this was about 20 minutes, huh? Yeah. After 20 minutes, it's still moist. Yeah, still moist. All right, y'all, let's get to it. And then I can put my glasses back on and see y'all. So we got the clear water here. So let's take this off. So I'm gonna let y'all see it up close, what it looks like, can y'all see? Okay. How does that look? Let's see. So I left some, so that's what it looks like on my face. And then I'm gonna take this little bit of water. And I am going to wipe this. Okay. There we go. And then I left one end dry so that I can dry. So there we go. So that's my face. Ooh, got some laundry or whatever you want to call it. Debris from the towel. So that's what it looks like. So what do you guys think? I think it looks good. It feels good. Let me put my second eyes on y'all so I can see. There she goes. I can see her now. I'm all up in y'all's face. Yes. Okay, you guys. So this is it finished. We just pulled it out of the oven. Ooh. So 
So that edge did really good protecting those edges. And we're going to let just a little bit of drippage there. That's fine. Ooh, it smells so good. Okay, so we're going to let it. Oh, yeah, it is hot. Okay, you guys, I wanted to come back and let you know that I did put it in the oven for 10 more minutes. I wanted to get a little bit more browner. And so this is what it looks like. Okay. Okay, you guys, so I am about to make this organic apple. About to make this organic apple Dijon salad. So let me get it all in here and then we can put all of the ingredients together. Stay tuned. This is the salad and it is the apple Dijon and what comes in it is the apple Dijon vinaigrette, dried cranberries, walnuts, and shredded cheddar cheese. And it is the organic apple Dijon kit. So this is the kit here. This is the shredded um, the shredded um, cheddar cheese. This is the apple Dijon salad dressing. This is the cranberries that come in here. Okay, so you guys, we're gonna go in here and we're gonna, should I just cut from here? Yeah, from this end? Yeah, cut it like a pie. Okay. You want about that size? Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's flaky. Okay, now this is where mommy's gonna pull hers out. I don't know if that spatula, maybe one of those little spatulas over there. Hold on, let's try y'all. This is where you need the pie. Okay. <laughs> anyway, here, come come closer. Y'all see how hot it is though. She gonna break it up anyway, so. I am. Ooh. <laughs> Looks good. So look at this consistency. It's very, very hot all the way through. You can even add extra chicken to this if you want. Let me give you a quick review of my opinion about the Marie Callender chicken pot pie. I think it was fantastic. Um, it is not homemade. If you want to make a homemade, you can make a homemade. But for something really quick through the week, on the weekend, you don't have time, you can get this, pull it out, put it in the oven, hour and 30 minutes we cooked it for. And um, I even took the, I uh, even wrapped it with the foil and you see that it kept the crust really, really nice. The inside, if you want to add um, extra vegetables, you can add broccoli to this. You can add extra beans or peas to this. Whatever vegetable you like, you can add it to that. It does give a lot of filling. Just want to show you how flaky that crust is. The crust was really, really flaky. And if I can pull a piece of meat out, what I loved about the chicken here is that it's not like that fake chicken. If you can see the texture of that chicken there, it's not fake. It's literally like someone cut up chicken breast and just did it in little squares and added to it. So I did appreciate that um, all white meat. And so this is the crust at the bottom. That did well. No burning, as you can see there. Um, and a lot of carrots it had. A lot of carrots. A lot of peas. You can taste the carrots a little bit. The peas, not. I think it's just for color and just to, you know, trick your mind. You got some vegetables in there. But like I said, add extra vegetables. Add extra chicken. And it will even be better. But I love it. I give it two thumbs up something quick and easy that you don't have to stand at the stove and do it yourself through the week so you guys i give it two thumbs up i am happy as you can see <laughs> mommy went back and got seconds that's how good it was, it was but yes it's really 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 good so this is my plate you can add like i said brown rice or some extra chicken but this is it right here and you guys it tastes just like old school chicken pot pie pie and it is delicious. So this is lunch for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video with the face mask. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you like what you see on this channel, this is your first time, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you leave a comment below and also hit that thumbs up.
you guys thank you so much for tuning in you be blessed on this good friday and hope you have a wonderful beautiful resurrection weekend thank you so much for tuning in remember keep god first trust him and he'll always lead you in the right direction bon appetit goodbye